Welcome back to Character Select. I hear bells. I can hear bells ringing. Wake up, Chrono. Remember this? This is the very beginning of the game. So we went back in time. Wait a minute. You'll be late for work. I can't advance this. This is all automatic. I'd forgotten how beautiful Nini's bell can sound. Chrono, we can't keep sponging off my dad. Go out and get a job. Sponging? Mm-hmm. Is that a thing the kids say nowadays? Oh, no. Chrono, 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 Chrono! If, if they're supposed to be married, that is not a big enough bed. Yeah. That's not actually explained either, that whole sequence. Chrono awake? Ayla! Ayla had a strange dream. Went to Mystic Mountains. Everyone lie there hurt. I carry back to Hut. Magus! Yummy frog for Ayla eat. <laughs> Whither the blue haired one? Only find you there. Blue guy, one more tasty? We have lost him. Magus said that was. Magus. Can't fucking do it. Jesus. Heck Magus one. Said, Heck one. Magus said that Lavos was born in the distant past. Lavos, not worry now. You rest. Her bad. Yeah, apparently, getting thrown through a giant time gate takes it out of you. Who knew? It hasn't affected us so far. Yeah. Well, giant time gate. Also, I don't know if you caught the implication, but apparently uh, Lavos created that giant time gate. So the implication is that Lavos is creating the time gates. So he is stopping himself from being born. What happened? Quiet. Chrono rest. Northwood burning. So we will go investigate that. All right. So the... This is apparently a burned down village. It looks more like just a foggy. Oh, it's smoke. Oh, maybe they're hosting a big rave here later, and they got a fog machine going. Or they're just smoking like. It would tons explain of the gunch. purple hair. And that all would also explain the purple hair. <laughs> um, that is not not a natural hair color. It's true. I guess. I mean... Reptite's following you. So out of the pit, it just ruined. Reptite's strong. Reptite strong. Are you really going to go with that voice now? Mark, you, you have a problem? Yeah, a little bit. Oh, no, Old man freak, but dead on inside. We no have power. Have power. We fight. Gain more power. Ayla help you, but need Dactyl. Give Dactyl. Need Dactyl? Go to Tyranno Lair? That reptite's place. Dangerous. Ayla won't die. Want to live, so go there. Ayla be okay. Give Dactyl. <laughs> These guys. Just. Complete. 100%. Just. Ridiculous. No concept of bartering? You, take care of Ayla. I love how he's just like, you, random person, take care of that girl. Alright. They just complete stereotypes, you know? It's racist. It's completely cool. racist. So, this For, guy is new well, Just once. Theory. Just once, I want to go, like, back in time to BCs or whatever in some game, and the uh, uh, primitives are all like, oh yes, how are you doing today? Oh, tip top. But you want them to be British? Yeah. Ugh. Just to, like, speak. Why would you ever want that? I'm just kidding. <laughs> just, like, speak normally. Or poshly. Whatever. Poshly? Poshly, poshly is not a word. It's what they speak at Poshly Station. <laughs> poshly Station is not a place. Yeah, it's the, the sister city to Toshly Station. I don't think that's true either. Um, we're hunting again because they have new stuff and we need more stuff to gather the stuff. So, yet more grind. I think there's only like one other instance of grinding after this. So, and even yet then, more grinding. Only, the grinding at that point is only because I really want to... 
I like to have uh, all of my text before a certain point. So, so they make the rest of the game super easy. Easy. Why am I still using Luca and Frog? Well, Frog's cool. Why am I still using Luca? Uh, because she's Bulma? She doesn't suck. <laughs> Her she ultimate suck weapon. sucked my dick. Come on, man. Hey, you went there. No, I didn't. When? You set that up. No, I didn't. A little bit. Not even close. A little bit. Just keep telling yourself. Okay, I will. A right. little bit. Ooh, I think we A little bit, me. A little bit. What, what are these slime things? Why do they have, like, crowns on their head? It's an ion and an anion. What? What even are they? Ions and anions. That, that does not. Triple raid! So we just learned our first triple tech. Okay, wanna cool. cool. Want to see it? Sure. Can't. I gotta use it against one enemy. Oh, now it's raining. And now Can't. it's dark! What the- Whoa! That was whoa. quick. I've never seen that happen. And now it's so light. It just got dark. And then still do. Ooh, this is cool. Not supposed to happen like this, but okay. It, it, this is the end of the world. Uh, the end of the world is 65 and, and million see? 2,000 years. It's dark and raining again. And you new bastard. It's the end of the world as we know it. Uh, I think you can. Only, I think you can only kill him once. I could be wrong on that. Internet, feel free to correct me. Uh, the internet will? Yeah. Well, probably. Not. <laughs> Who am I kidding? More chrono murder. Yeah. Killing innocent frogs who are just trying to go out for a shower in the rain. Those frogs have feathers and horns and fangs. So? Frog in your party has a fucking cape and a sword. Yeah, because he's badass. Also, they're actually croakers, amphibites, and a rain frog. Uh, can I just say I love Frog's victory pose? Just shows off his jack and arm. <laughs> Have you seen that clip? <laughs> clip from Family. Family Guy. Yeah. Oh, uh, the best. Quagmire finds the internet. Just hey. been looking at hey. that. Uh, hey, Peter. You, uh, that internet porn. <laughs> heard about this internet thing? Oh, uh, uh, can we? Ha can we haven't gone outside in three weeks. I want to. I, like, I almost want to see if we can actually show that right in the middle. Put of a clip place. up right now. No. Nope. Do it. Pretty sure that's gonna result in some sort of copyright infringement. If you can't put it up, put a crude drawing of it up. No, not gonna happen either. Do it. You're gonna disappoint people if you don't. Oh, look at that. Look at that. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. No, it isn't. That MF it's paint still the same. drawing? No. Not unless you're drawing it. That was triple raid. X slash followed by a super tackle. Uh, underwhelming. Can I just say? Oh, that jacked arm again. Put up that drawing again. No. There's no drawing. Yeah, it's right there. The people Jim? can see it. I swear to God, you're fired if you do that. Jim, put up a drawing. Jim, you're fired if you do that. I don't have the time to do find it, another Jim. fucking editor. Exactly, your job's safe, Jim. <laughs> you can do anything you want. No, he can't. You can tell, you can tell Dave to go fuck himself? No, huh? Huh? whoa, 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 wait a minute. Jim, if you do uh, that, I'll probably laugh a little bit. That, but no, uh, don't do it. Don't. That, that'll probably get you in trouble. Uh, well, that kind of went off on a little bit of a tangent. <laughs> As what? things are wont to do. Still want trade? What, what are we even getting from these guys? A uh, dream bow, a dream gun, a magma hand, an aeon blade. And that's it. Magma hand. Still want three? Because when you're going to punch something, it might as well be made of extremely hot molten magma. Yeah. 
Yeah, their armor hasn't gotten any better though, so the ruby vest is still the thing of the day. I, I do question the usefulness of something made out of uh, rubies, Ru uh, yeah, r rare gemstones. Um, I would think that if nothing else, they would be extremely valuable. True. <laughs> True. Uh, however, ridiculous. would not stand up to weapons very easily. The ruby is actually pretty hard material. Yeah, but we're talking about you know it could get sharp and stuff. But we're talking about like bashing; it'll it'll shatter. I don't think so. Probably. No, I don't. Think. I don't think you're right. I, I don't think it can handle sudden impact like that. No, I, I don't. Unless you make it out of unobtainium. Well, if you make anything out of unobtainium, it can do whatever the fuck you want it to do. All right, Unfortunately, just... that's impossible because it's unobtainable. <laughs> Hence the name unobtainium. Exactly. Roll credits. <laughs> Thank you for pointing out the blatantly obvious. Oh, are you going to kick the shist out of these guys? Yes. I was going to make that joke, and then you took it from me. So now yep. I has, now I has a sad. You, you literally ripped that guy a new asshole. <laughs> look, look. On his back. See, there, there he's got a new asshole. Yep. We couldn't put it at the butt. That's where the old asshole is. I don't see what that has to do with anything. Why couldn't I? All right. Yeah. So, remember how Chrono has, uh... This super awesome hits everything with lightning attack. Yeah. Remember how dinosaurs don't like lightning? <laughs> For some strange reason. Well, quite frankly, you wouldn't like being shocked by lightning either, I'm sure. No, no. It's like that, that, that was not as impressive as you were leading, it, leading me to believe. Yeah, no. They're too strong and Chrono's magic status. It, it basically just looked like a, uh, a scene from Sailor Moon. By the power of the moon, I shall defeat all evil. All dinosaurs. I don't, I don't know, I've never actually seen oh, Sailor Moon. I would pay to see Sailor Moon fighting dinosaurs in 65 million BC. What? Why? Why not? Because it doesn't make sense. Sailor Moon doesn't make sense. I think that's true of a lot of anime. So you question Sailor Moon fighting dinosaurs? Why? Because there's no dinosaurs in Sailor Moon. Let's at least be consistent within the internal plot logistics of our own goddamn show, shall we? <laughs> I wasn't there's... aware where there was an internal consistency here. Well, Sailor Moon, yeah, it goes on long enough and nothing has internal consistency anymore. Yeah. I mean, it's set on Earth. There are dinosaurs there. Not anymore. I said in 65 million BC. Uh, well, I put guess... it up, Jim. Jim doesn't have the ability or the time to do that, do you, Jim? No. He's not going to sit here and animate a whole freaking Sailor Moon fan episode just for you. No, I meant put up the quote of me saying in 65 million BC. Oh, you wanted us to do a flashback, you say? Yes. No. Oh, I would pay to see Sailor Moon fighting dinosaurs in 65 million BC. This is the episode where I take advantage of Jim. Sorry, Jim, but I'll, I'll buy you dinner next time. That's not going to happen. He's not doing flashback. He, he's already done it. I mean, no, I don't know hasn't. what you're complaining about. Jim, We've already seen it. Jim, did you do a flashback? Did you See, do yep. a flashback? Talk to me. Tell me honestly. Did you do a flashback? I'm so disappointed in you right now. Way to go, Jim. Oh, my... I can't I'll fire buy me a beer next time we meet. <laughs> <sighs> By next time we meet, I mean the first time we meet. Yes, well. As far as I know, Jim is just this crazy, sentient computer. Kind of, sort of, actually. <laughs> I didn't want to reveal it before now, but Jim is, in fact, a crazy-centric computer. 
uh, luckily he cares more about editing uh, video game footage than uh, taking over the world. It's true. He's Unlike like his uh, renegade brother Skynet. We don't talk about Skynet around here. Sorry, sorry, Jim. No, that's a sore subject. Hmm. Actually, now I kind of... Totally random aside, I kind of wish I had a beer right now. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I can go for a beer. Well, not a beer, cider. Sorry, I don't, I don't do You're not bitter. a beer man? No, no. Are you a I, in fact, uh... Prefer uh, fruity fruit fruit drinks. Fruity fruit fruit drinks. Fruity fruit fruit drinks. Okay. Give me a good daiquiri or a margarita. Yeah, I guess I can see that. Something in which I cannot taste the alcohol. Mm, Nearly yeah. loads of sugar. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Hey, we found the dactyl. Oh, the surprise! Surprise. It's a non-existent yeah. creature thing. It's a pterodactyl. Curdo! Thou goest forth alone? I know not thine quest, but a comrade of Kronos is also mine. Not allow thee to meet thy demise alone. It's ran away or dangerous. Maybe I'll perish. Desire to perish? I refuse it to be party to yet another demise. Let us proceed, Kronos. Frog, just just back off. We, we've already claimed Ayla. <laughs> you know. Who should we take with us to the Tyranno Lair? Because we now have to take Ayla. Uh, Ayla and uh, Chrono and uh, I don't know Marley. All right. Just turn this into a harem. Yeah. It's only three spots in there. For, or, no, for maybe, no Frog. Was... Frog. Frog's bro. Okay, never mind. Fuck it. We've already taken off. And now we're flying on pterodactyls. Because that is totally a thing that happens without any preamble whatsoever. Pretty much. And now we're suddenly flying over the everything. Why? Isn't so next this time the point where you, What? Isn't this the point where you usually get like a, a, a flying machine and a airship? No. These sorts of games? This game doesn't have Instead one of those. pterodactyls? The game doesn't have one of those. So, just be taking these pterodactyls through time with us. Whee! Alright, next time on Character Select, we're gonna go to the Tyranno Lair. It's gonna be fantastic. I hate Fan the fucking Tyranno. fucking-tastic. It's the worst level in the fucking game.